Welcome to another TA Tech Tip. In this TA Tech Tip, we will use the three-point bending clamp to demonstrate dynamic mechanical analysis capabilities on the Discovery Hybrid Rheometer. Using the force rebalance transducer, the DHR is a rotational rheometer capable of performing dynamic mechanical analysis. The three-point bending clamp can be used to study viscoelastic properties of a solid rectangular sample in the horizontal position. Typical tests with this configuration include amplitude sweeps to determine the linear viscoelastic region, time sweeps to determine stability, frequency sweeps to determine viscoelastic properties, and temperature ramp or sweeps to determine thermal transitions, measure modulus, and collect TTS data for master curve generation. When mounted on the DHR, the three-point bending clamp is used in tandem with the environmental test chamber for temperature control. The kit includes the upper and lower fixtures, an alignment tool, a screwdriver for switching frame sizes, calipers, and 10, 25, and 40 millimeter sized frames. Mount the fixtures to the DHR with the 25 millimeter frame and choose the three point bending geometry from the drop down menu in the Trios ribbon. Place the alignment tool onto the frame. Then manually rotate the motor shaft to align the upper fixture with the alignment tool. Using the up and down buttons on the keypad, Carefully lower the upper geometry until the geometry is fully inserted into the V-slot on the alignment tool. Use the TRIO software to read the alignment position through the geometry's calibrations. You can also choose to have the instrument tear the gap during the calibration. Tearing the gap sets the current position as the zero point. Once finished, raise the head to remove the alignment tool and perform the axial mapping. You can now use the Move to Alignment Position button in the motor control panel at any time to return the geometry to the alignment position. This guarantees the geometries are always aligned with one another during testing. Use the screwdriver to remove the 25 millimeter frame and install a different size frame if desired. Use the calipers to measure and enter the sample width and thickness under the geometry file Choose the correct frame size from the drop-down menu. Simply raise the instrument head, move the motor to the alignment position, and load the sample onto the test geometries. Use the up and down arrows to carefully lower the upper geometry until a small amount of axial force is registered, indicating that the geometry is in contact with the sample. The three-point bending clamp is now ready for testing. Test procedures include axial force control in compression to maintain contact between the geometry and sample during testing, followed by an oscillation step. This oscillation step can include an amplitude sweep to determine the linear viscoelastic region, a frequency sweep for viscoelastic characterization, a time sweep to determine stability, or a temperature ramp or sweep to measure thermal transitions and modulus as a function of temperature. In this TA Tech Tip, we have demonstrated the setup and use of the three-point bending clamp for performing dynamic mechanical analysis on solid rectangular samples using the Discovery Hybrid Rheometer. For more information on test setup, sample dimensions, and other available geometries, please refer to the online TRIOS help. Stay tuned for more helpful TA Tech Tips, and thank you for your interest.